It was August 29, 2002. The 2002 MTV Video Music Awards, the show was hosted by Jimmy Fallon at the Radio City Music Hall in New York City. A wide variety of celebrities attended the event, including Eminem, Justin Timberlake, Shakira. But the most notable guest set to make an appearance was the king of pop, Michael Jackson. The night was looking up, Jackson was all set to be awarded the Artist of the Millennium Award. Or was he? Originally as a point of mockery for the artist and just seen as another example of the series of public blunders the artist faced in the new millennium. But that night was meticulously prepared for the king of pop to make a grand reintroduction and almost went perfectly. He had agreed to make an appearance at the show for a much needed ratings boost. In return MTV were supposed to yield to his demands. The artist was set to be awarded a new and very prestige award, while being introduced by none other than the princess of pop, Britney Spears, arguably at the height of her pop powers and influence. Spears would be introduced on stage by Michael Jackson's idol James Brown and she would wish the artist a happy birthday, given that the award ceremony was being held on his 44th birthday and dub him the artist of the millennium. This is someone who has inspired me and just about everybody in this room and the world. I consider him the artist of the millennium. Jackson would enter stage pulling a trophy off the cake he was being presented. The whole thing would quickly descend into anarchy when Jackson began his acceptance speech. Wow. Um, God bless you. Um, I love you too. Um, uh, thank you very much, um, Britney Spears. You look wonderful. Um, if, uh, when I was a little boy in Indiana, if someone had told me, if someone had told me that one day I would be getting, as a musician, um, the Artist of the Millennium Award, I wouldn't have believed it. <laughs> um, this is really amazing. I can't believe it. Um, thank you so very much, but there's a couple of people I have to thank who made this possible. First, I'd like to thank um, God, who makes all things possible. My mother, Joseph Jackson, Catherine Jackson, Barry Gordy, Diana Ross, Gladys Knight, Quincy Jones, I love you. David Blaine, your magic is real and I believe in you. And I'd like to thank, I think James Brown is a genius. Uh, And all the fans around the world, I love you. God bless you. Thank you. After initially blowing up in raucous applause, you could hear a pin drop in the audience when Jackson dropped the non-existent award in his Oscar-worthy spiel. The crowd had to pretend to be moved as they maintained a standing ovation throughout. Considering this was a room full of performers, they didn't deliver a very convincing acting job. Briefly getting herself together after the cringe-worthy scenes, Spears pushed on to present Best Pop Video, while Jackson awkwardly moved to the back of the stage. After the awards, a spokesperson for the channel said the moment was a bit of a misunderstanding. There is no such award as the Artist of the Millennium. I think some wires got crossed, the spokesperson said. The next year Jack Black participated in a parody of the event where he mocked Jackson. embarrassing moment for Michael as he accepts an award they weren't even giving out. I'd like to uh, accept the Artist of the Millennium Award myself. I guess they're giving them backstage. Everyone's getting them. Uh, not only is it VMA night, but it also happens to be the birthday of someone that I consider to be very, very, very funny. I'd like to bring him out right now. Ladies and gentlemen, the one and only Mr. Jack Black. <laughs> Seriously, people, if someone had told me 
when I was a little kid that I was gonna win the Super Genius of the Universe Award, I'd have said, you know way, you're crazy. And I won it! I won it! Despite all these jokes at Jackson expense, insiders would reveal that higher-ups had MTV pull the award to teach Jackson a lesson. This was around the time of the big falling out Jackson had with Sony. MTV pretended like Jackson went up on stage and gave himself an award, or had a misunderstanding of how he was being honored that night, his birthday by the way. But it was apparent from the MTV website that the award was set to be awarded to Jackson and it was presumably yanked to only make him look like a fool.